hello and welcome back to my youtube channel it's done here so we are working with the love from lizzie kit today um for october so there is an unboxing if you'd like to see everything that was in it um yeah i think it might be a little difficult one um to work with oh we have got a lot of cutter parts which is really nice so we'll be definitely using them and the stickers and yeah i was trying to work out what we were missing it was ephemera um in the unboxing and it actually does <laughs> but we have the ephemera it's just in sheet form that's why it looked like there was something missing so yeah honestly um i think it's just when i was looking at it, it was early morning thinking am i missing something uh we i won't be using that um right okay let's get all of this uh, bits and pieces out and let's see where we're going to start uh, because I have no idea. I have got my card bases. I'm doing A6 card bases. I think first of all we need ephemera because um, we don't really have any. So let's cut these up. So I'm just going to do this. Right. Oh, there is so much to be grateful for. Stay a while, making beautiful memories, and home is with you. Um, okay, let's, I'm going to have to do these in bits. Okay. I think if I cut these bits up, what I'll do is I'm going to cut all the cut parts up, um, except for this sheet because I'm not going to use them on cards. We'll use the back side of that one. Uh, so I'll do it off camera just because it's going to take a while. And then we'll come back. Okay, we're back. Right, I've done that. Um, I didn't do this one either. Um, I've left that one. Just because um, I quite like the other side as well. And we don't actually have a lot of pattern paper. I think there's only like 10 sheets of uh, pattern paper. So I thought, let's just see what we could do first. Um, and then I can always cut them down later. Right, okay, I'm going to grab the patterned paper. And I definitely want to use this Dougie one because it's so cute. And I definitely want to use the B one. Um, that one would be good for a background. I like that mustard. Why is it you like both sides? Um, oh, I don't know. I don't know. Do you know what? I think I'm just going to use the coloured cardstock because I can't quite decide. Although I don't, I'm not quite keen on that one, so that one would go quite nice. Um, and I like that one as well. Right. Okay. Right. So I've got a couple of sheets out. So I'm just going to cut these down now. I want. I want one with the little lady in. Oh, perfect. So I'm going to do three inch by three inch. Cause she fits in perfectly. She's just there. Um, I am going to grab this plaid piece and I'm going to cut a piece that is four by five and three quarters because that's the size of the card now i'm going to grab the navy blue card stock and we're going to do a couple of matted layers um oh i want this to be sorry quarter of an inch shorter so this is three and three quarters by five and a half so this piece needs to be uh five and three quarters by four so that's gonna go on there like that and then i need another bit that is three and a quarter by three and a quarter and then that bit is gonna go on there like that and then we do have this piece which i'm just going to put across the bottom there and um oh do i want that i think how we want this one either mid yeah that one right okay so this is our first card together 
Now I am going to use some of the washi tape, so let's use the matching washi tape to the paper. Um, and you cut this down to four, so I can wrap my ends around. Okay. So just like this. And you need to make sure it's straight, move you out the way. I'm thinking I might put some of that gold on as well. There we go. So wrap those ends around. And then we've got the gold stripe actually. Oh do I want the butterflies? the butterflies along the bottom that's not quite straight okay I'll just like that oh, I like that that looks nice right okay so um oh that's what I wanted to do I wanted to top my glue up right let me top my glue up and I'll be back right Okay, we're back. Um, <laughs> I just pressed record and realised that my music was still playing. So, my glues are filled up. Um, so, I've got a tiny bit left in this bottle. So, I'm going to use this bottle um, until I can't get any more out. Because uh, as crafters, we like to save as much stuff as we can. Now, um, all I'm doing now is I'm just sticking them down. I'm thinking, is it 10 o'clock? Because the alarms are going off. Yeah, oh, it is. <laughs> uh, so it's a Tuesday here um, and we have alarms go off. Um, we live the, I live very close to ICI um, and they do um, like um, drill alarms every Tuesday at 10. And every third Wednesday, like third month on a Wednesday as well, um, and in my lifetime, I think it, they've only gone off once when they're not supposed to. Um, and there was a big, like, yellow, uh, not yellow, orange cloud above us, um, which was, oh, I've just, yeah, oh, I thought I'd, um, these were a different card base then, but yeah. Um, so if you can hear them, I do apologise. Uh, they go off for about... I don't know actually I've never sort of looked I'm gonna say it, about 15 minutes um, but yeah if the alarms go off so the drill is is if the alarms go off you are to stay in your house until they stop so yeah um, and not many people knew that it's from when this place was built I think uh, yeah I'm, do you know what I'm gonna have that just there so I'm just going to cut that. Now I am going to layer this up just because it's um, yeah really going to stand off there. So let's stick them on because that's the same size. Okay. I might need another one, but let's have a look. Yeah, we need one more on there. And then we should be, we should be good to go. But yeah, I never know if it comes through on the camera because I don't tend to listen um, back. So you'll have to let me know if you can hear the alarms. Right, I'm loving that. I think that looks lovely. Um, I was going to say, I had a tiny bit of the blue card left, so I'm going to do a little banner. Okay. Um, so it's one inch by three quarters of an inch that I'm going to do. Okay. And I think that's going to just go here, there. Okay. We 
because we can't really see that doggy's head anyway. And then let's finish off with just a couple of the gems. Yeah, they're getting louder now. Um, so one, two, and three. There we go. Oh, I think I want another two. Yeah, let's have another two. One there and one there. Perfect. So that is our first card. Absolutely gorgeous. Loving it. Um, we've got our little lady there. And that could actually be Quincy. Oh, I love him. Anyway. Right, okay. Second card. Now, really liking this bee paper. So I think we're gonna start off with that. Um, let's do a matted layer. So I'm gonna do four by five and three quarters and then this piece will do three and three quarters by five and a half so that's going to sit there i'm going to have this bit go just across like that um what size are we so um and i'm going to have this piece at one inch actually no let's do the back side of this so one inch okay so let's glue this down come on like so uh, i need something for it to go in because it doesn't fit in my little glue pot um but if it stays that way it's so much better right i'm just going to stick that on there like so okay making sure it's as straight as i can get it and then while that's drying let's stick these down okay yeah have it just like that right um so there's the first bit and then let's glue this bit down okay there's that bit and then i'm gonna have this just going across like that so let's glue that okay so that's just gonna get glued across there like that and then i'm gonna just cut down the side because i do want this to reach the whole edge if you don't want it to reach the whole edge then do this before you stick your base down Oh, love it love 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 right let's get rid of these little bits um and then um where's the sticker sheet let's have a look i should have really looked to see what was on here first um course i don't think there's any bees Arr, no there isn't there is a lady though we have a lady uh, it might be butterflies instead that we use so i'm gonna cut what size is this let's see what size that is that is a two and a half by three and a quarter so i'm gonna grab the white card stock and i'm gonna cut a piece that is two and a quarter so two and a quarter by three okay um let's have a look yeah see there's no bees on there either right um i think it's going to be flowers so yeah that is just about run out okay And then we do need to pop some dimension under it. Okay. Like that. So one and two. Um, have I done that the right way or is that the wrong way? No that's the right way but to get over there 
There we go. Ah, oh, much better. Yeah, right, so let's glue this on. Like so. And I'm just going to stick that on there like that. Make sure that's in. Perfect. Oh, let's have a look at these actually. See what we've got in here. I know it's very, oh, I like that. I was going to say, I was very tempted for flowers and that one just seems to go perfectly. Um, I like that there's a lot of thank yous because I send a lot of thank you cards. Um, I really like that. Um, let's have a look. I think, I think that's the best one actually, guys. Yeah, that's the best one. I'm loving it. And I love how that looks on there as well. Really simple, but I think it just it just works. So we're going to stick that on there like so. Um, let's have a look. Is there anything off here I would like? I think I like this. And just to go along that bottom edge there oh how nice does that look that looks lovely um what else what else i think that's it i'm looking at it thinking i don't know if i really want anything else i think the only thing would be the gold hearts but no i'm leaving it i like it as is um so there we are that is our second card all done Right, on to our next card. Oh, what are we going to choose? Right, let's keep all these scrap bits because we will do something with those scrap bits at the um, at some point. Right, let's do... Oh, I like these oranges. They're nice. Yeah, I like them. Right, okay, so we're going to do four... Actually, no, I'm going to do two inch strip like this by five and three quarters. And then this piece, I'm going to do three inches by four. So a little bit different. Because um, normally I fill the whole card up, but we're not going to today. So, and then before I change my mind or look at it properly, we're just going to stick it down. Okay, so this bit's going to go there. I've been enjoying doing this style, actually. So if you watched the How Many Cards Using Pat Stash, I did a lot of cards in this, and it used a lot of stash up. Um, and it just, they look lovely. Really, really nice. Right, okay, there we go. So, love that instantly. Um, now, we do have, there's a couple of options. Um, but they're the same size. Yeah, I don't want to use them. Um, we can use some of the uh, stickers. Oh, we can use these. I'm just going to see what we have. Um, oh, now that heart is part of that bit, which I really like. Um, let's have a look. Oh, with that across there, I like that as well. Do you know what? let's do it let's keep it simple right so i'm just going to cut a little bit off that and then we're going to cut our banner shape okay um let's glue that down so that's going to go just across like that and then we're going to have this gold heart down not gold heart sorry floral heart oh, I love that that's so simple but how cute I love it now do I want to add anything else to this Part. oh yeah let's add just a little bit of foil now I am going to glue this down because it is washi tape washi tape is a low tack tape and doesn't stick forever so if you're going to do a piece of washi tape on your card if you don't wind it around the back I highly recommend that you put glue down 
um, and then that will make that last um, but it just gives that lovely bit of accent doesn't it how lovely is that now I think off the sticker sheet we're going to go with the gold hearts to embellish this so one there and one there and do I want the big one do you know what let's use um yeah like that where's there should be five I'm sure yeah there is I was gonna say I'm sure I saw five because I wouldn't have started sticking them down otherwise right and there we have it so that is card number three that is so beautiful I really like that that washi just I don't know pulls it all together it looks lovely right next one um I'm going to come back in with this piece um so let's cut that down so it's already at four inches um so I've cut it down to five and three quarters and that's going to stick on here so let's just get our glue okay like so right and then we do have you know ooh, quite like that to go with it just trying to work out if i actually want that on because uh, what i'm thinking is we're going to use one of these i like that one um i think that one looks better uh we didn't get any orange did we actually right we did get this green card so maybe let's use this right these are three by four i think if yeah so i want a piece that is three and three quarters by four no three and one quarter by four and one quarter yeah so that's going to go on there and then this if i remember right it should be an inch but it's not it's um i'm going to cut it down to one inch okay and then i'm going to cut this piece to one and a quarter inch let's stick that down by five and three quarters i'm going to do that with both excellent right okay so those are my bits sorted together um so let's get them glued down okay I'm trying to keep it as straight as possible there we are right um the other thing i think you know that's size is i'm gonna grab some of this washi tape so the smaller washi tape of the with the flowers i'm gonna put a piece of that down as well now i am wrapping this around the back so i know that it will be fine okay so let's stick this down on glue like this okay so there's that and then i'm going to stick this one down like so now because this is hanging off i am just going to cut some of this cardstock just this bit of scrap and we're going to glue this down onto the back okay and then that means that that'll sit nicely which it does okay just some glue on so just like that so there's that how lovely does that look that looks so pretty and then nope i don't know if i want to add anything else i think the only thing is maybe adding some gems now these are on a line which makes life so much easier 
because I'm just going to stick the three of them down this bottom bit here in a line and because they're already in a line it means I get to keep them straight and then we have it that is card number four right let's make our last card for uh, today so um, I think I'm going to go with the scraps let's have a look so another doggy one I think could be nice obviously we want to keep the lady doggy in right I'm going to cut these down to five and three quarters just so that they fit nicely right and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick this piece down first okay just like that and then we're going to stick this doggy part down just like that okay loving that then I am going to put a strip of glue down there and we're going to grab this washi tape with the um, gold and cream on and I'm going to use this as a peel off I'm just going to pop that down and then using my scissors trim that off there we go oh, again it just brings it nicely together right, I just want to get it so that there we go right okay loving that now let's have a look <coughs> no oh like it but it'll need a matted layer or best wishes would be nice but i think i'd have it there oh i like that um thank you no hello friend oh Hello friend goes quite nice. Feel better soon. Oh, that one definitely goes quite nice. Why have I put it up there? That one goes nice. Slow down and catch up. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, I think the feel better soon is the nicest one. Yeah. Right, okay, so we're going to use the feel better soon. So let's glue that down. And there we have our fifth card done. Um, I am going to put some gems on. Because we can just like that. There we go. So let me just move all of this stuff out of the way, um, like so. Right, if I can pick it up, there is. Okay, I move my washies. I'll just start putting everything up there. Right. Let's get rid of all of these little bits. I'm going to keep that card just in case we need it uh, when I do the next five pieces for a bit of dimension. Um, but here are the five cards that we have created in today's video. So I hope you've enjoyed it and it's given you a little bit of inspiration. I have to say, I think they look absolutely gorgeous. I am loving them. Um, yeah that's it really for today thank you again for watching i'll be back with part two very very soon um but until then please do take care and happy crafting bye